During one of his toughest times, Paul Cattermole made a heartbreakingly kind act after a Loose Women appearance. The S Club 7 legend, who has tragically died at the age of 46, didn't have enough money to pay for a new outfit for his TV appearance back in 2018. Keen to have Paul be on the show, Loose Women bosses gave him a smart black long sleeve top so he could entertain fans and speak about his life. They expected that the singer would keep the shirt, but Paul kindly decided to leave it behind, and took to Twitter afterwards to explain why. Paul heartbreakingly explained that he didn't want anyone to think that he was stealing the shirt. Thanks to all the ladies at Loose Women thanks for being so nice, he tweeted the show's official account. I left the shirt in the dressing room. Just in case you though I had pilfered it. Fans flocked to Paul after his admission, telling him he was brave to talk about how little money he had after the success of S Club 7. I was so moved by your interview. Such a brave thing to do. It must have been so difficult for you. I hope you are soon in a better situation. Emotionally and financially. And remember that there are a lot of people who love and care for you. Always remember that, one said. I just wanted to give you a big hug and invite you over for a cooked meal after hearing of your financial troubles. Hope it looks up for you, wrote another. A third told him, keep your head held high. Your life will turn around. Keep positive. I always say think positive and positive things happen. The singer opened up about his serious money troubles on Loose Women during a very emotional interview. When Jane asked whether any family members had helped him out with his money troubles, he insisted that his mom has helped in a big way this year. He also said that he was very keen to dip his toe into reality TV, citing Dancing on Ice and Im a celeb as examples, but quipped, for some reason they don't want me. Paul was an S Club favorite, and broke hearts across the nation when it was announced he was quitting the band back in 2002. It had got to the point where things were being handled so badly, I had to go, Paul told The Guardian. Paul reunited with some old school friends to form new metal group Skua, but they split in 2003 after failing to sign a record deal. Five years after S Club broke up, Paul started performing at nightclub, universities and holiday camps across the UK with Joe and Bradley as S Club 3.